Hello guys, this is Green Cave. Our last seed died, so here we are again for germination. The strain of this season is White Widow. It's a feminized seed, so we will be stepping away from auto flowers. Although it's nice and easy that auto flowers flower on their own, you have way more control and training capabilities with photo periods. White Widow will be my second grow and it's my first time using photo periods. So let's start with the germination process. I'm going to use a Jiffy palette for my germination. They are cheap and make it very easy for beginner growers to germinate the seed. These dry pellets have to sit in a bit of water for around 5 to 10 minutes. You can use tap water, but I'm going to try and use pH corrected water from the very beginning in this grow. Make sure the Jiffy pellet is standing in a little pool of water and it's not floating. If the Jiffy pellet is too wet, it could hurt the seed and drown it. Last germination when my seed died, the Jiffy pellet was way too moisty. After 10 minutes, my Jiffy pellet has soaked up the water and it's nice and moisty. Carefully put the seed in the Jiffy pellet. Move just a little of the ground over the seat, but make sure there is enough oxygen in there. I put the Jiffy pellet in my grow tent where it is dark, warm and the humidity is between 80 and 90%. And now we wait. If you're enjoying the video, please be so kind to support the channel by giving a like. Subscribe for more videos like this one. Thanks! 5 days later and the seed came out of her hole. It's time to put her in a pot. I have only about half of a sack of soil left. This is the grow mix from Plagron. This soil contains enough nutrients for the first few weeks. Because we use the Jiffy pellet for germination, there isn't any stress cost in moving the plant to a bigger pot. Just dig a hole for the Jiffy pellet and get it in there. It's also time to start using our light. I'm using a 100 watt LED from Mars Hydro. It's around 100 euros and it's perfect for a small grow tent. A photo period cannabis plant needs a light schedule. In the vegetative stage, this is around 6 hours dark and 18 hours light. So I created my schedule in my smart plug app and plug everything in. I have a fan for airflow and an outtake fan with a carbon filter to mask the smell. Let's leave her alone for now. It's a day later and it's time to get some water flowing in that new soil. I have many different bottles of nutrients, but for now only pH correcting the water will do. I'm not gonna use anything else because the seedling is still very young. I fill my can with top water and the pH is always around 8. We need to get the pH between 6 and 7. I add just a tiny drop of pH down and it's still a little bit too high. Another drop, stir it around, it's perfect. I'm going to make sure to water around the Jiffy pellet and spread it evenly. This will encourage the roots to spread to the moisty areas. Make sure not to water directly on the seedling. This could damage it and be very bad. She's still growing good a day later. Two days later and the seedling has reached pretty high for the light. I'm going to move it down just a little. She reached the vegetative stage, so the next week we can start making her huge. Thanks for watching the start of White Widow. If you enjoyed, please be so kind to help the channel out by giving a like. Subscribe for next week's update in the vegetative stage. See you next week.